so about two months ago I set my driving test and uh, I fucking crow. <laughs> So about two months ago, I set my driving fucking birds. So nine. So about two months ago, I set my driving test for the very first time. I had been doing a driving course for six weeks to kind of get me up to date with how to drive, just how to be aware while I'm on the road. I'd never, I'd never had any driving experience before this. If those birds don't shut up, <laughs> seriously, <laughs> they've just decided to gather outside my window. And as part of the course, they booked the test for me, they paid for it. And uh, the reason I didn't show it was because after I came out of the driving test, I was recording it and the audio was just all broken up and stuff. So I've been looking back over the footage and I realise it's not actually that bad and I, I know I can fill it in with this kind of commentary. So I'm going to show you some of the footage and give you my result from the test. And uh, yeah, hope you enjoy. And yeah, I'll be back in a few minutes to talk about my results and yeah. What's the crack? Welcome to this week's episode. My name is David Kelly, I'm the Irish Guy Vlogs. And today, today I'm sitting my driving test and I'm absolutely shitting it. I'm not even joking, terrified. I'm walking out to the driving center now and I am just a bag of nerves. So I've been preparing for this for the past few months. I've done, I did a six week driving course. You haven't seen any of that, but you will in this video. Um, I only have like little snippets from when I was driving. Uh, but I'm just so nervous now. Since last Thursday, I've had five driving lessons. So I had a lesson Thursday, Friday, Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday. I just had my last lesson like an hour ago, and now I'm heading out to the center to sit my test for the first time. Ah, oh, Jesus. What am I doing? I'm not the only one. There was 12 people that did my course, only six of us went through. I'm feeling anxious for the others as well because uh, because I know that they really want to pass too and I really want them to pass as well. I just think it would be great if all of us passed uh, so we could all go out together and get drunk. <laughs> to be honest, I'm a little bit annoyed that I don't have much footage from the six weeks of the driving course. And a lot of that was because the tutors weren't comfortable with me recording in their cars. So by getting the license, I should at least find the job or at least make it easier to find the job for myself. And that will all have a knock-on effect on my life, you know. And so yeah, I think it's essential that I have to do it. And I have to do it now, so yeah. Let's do this! Ugh! Now I'm gonna go in and do my test and hopefully next time I see you, I'm gonna have some good news. So uh, yeah. Wish me luck. I failed. That's how it goes. I mean, I'm a little bit pissed off, but I know where I made the mistakes. I know where I went wrong. I guess that's the important thing. That's how it is. I'm gonna reapply. It's gonna cost me 85 f***ing euros. So my plan now is to go home, get into the fetal position, suck my thumb, and forget about the world for the next three weeks. Sounds like a plan. It was really, really annoying. And the reason why it was so annoying is because in the test, if you get nine or more grade twos, then you fail the test automatically. I got nine. So if I had just got one less, just one less, I would have passed. And I know where I made the mistakes. I was going too far in first gear, but the car I was actually driving allows you to kind of go f a bit further in first gear. So I was used to kind of doing that. Just this, such a stupid thing. And the most annoying thing is that I know I picked up a mark when I was going in the gate of the driving test, just right at the very, very end, I geared down a little bit and then it, it stuttered like the tiniest, tiniest bit and then I changed gear and, and caught it and fixed it. But that was the one that caught me and it's just so annoying to get that close, but you had to fail. But that's how it goes. I've learned a lot about driving since and one of the things that I noticed as well, because there was a lot of us on the course doing the test on the same day, two of us failed. I think out of the eight people that did it, two of us failed. And the two of us that failed were the only two that didn't have cars out of the Entire group so everyone else was used to driving the two of us that failed we weren't that used to driving we just got the practice from doing the course so we knew where we went wrong and I've been working on that since and because of that because of not having the experience of having a car I had to get insured in my mum's car so I've been driving around the net in the past few weeks and I'm legally on the road she has to drive with me because that's the law in Ireland you have to have a fully licensed driver with you I've been driving to different places I went to Ennis a couple of times uh, up around North Clare and stuff like that trying to focus on 
driving rather than vlogging. Yeah, it's just, it's just, it's getting better all the time, you know, and I am going to reset the test and I am going to make a better video about it. But I just thought you might find it interesting to know how I got on my first time around. And yeah, even though it was a fail, I think I learned a lot from it. And I know now that I'm a better driver than I was a couple of months ago back when I first set the test. I'm not nervous at all now behind the wheel. So um, next time around, I know it's going to be a lot better and I know I'm going to pass. Well, I hope I do anyway. <laughs> I know it's easy to get mad at the driving instructor to kind of say, oh, well, it was their fault, it was their judgment and stuff like that, but I know myself that I made mistakes, and for them to pass me, I think I would have kind of questioned their judgment because I did make mistakes, and that's just how it was, you know? So, yeah, I'm still learning, and, uh, yeah, next time's going to be better. And that's it. If you have any interesting stories about doing a driving test or anything like that, let me know down in the comments. I'd be really interested to hear about them. And that's it for today. I hope you enjoyed the video. I'll be back again next Friday with another one. If you're new to my channel and you like my content, you can subscribe down below and uh, yeah I'll see you all again next Friday thanks for watching and uh, yeah I hope it wasn't too embarrassing <laughs> with me failing but yeah so it goes I'll do better next time bye